What up, what up guys? Your boy GP here. I am in an area called Budlan in Cebu, the Philippines. I'm searching for a waterfall. I'm gonna take you guys there in a minute. But really quick, I just wanted to talk to you about the inner voice and trusting yourself, trusting your gut, because I know a lot of you guys read self-help books and spend countless hours on YouTube watching motivational speakers, looking for the answers. What I wanna tell you is this, the answers lie in trial and error in getting out there, doing it yourself, because you can listen to me all day, you can listen to anybody else, but until you go out and you, have, you face some bullshit, you face some problems in your life, you're never gonna know how to handle under pressure. You're just gonna fold. At the end of the day, you're just gonna fold. Um, really quick, I'm hiking, looking for the, looking for the uh, waterfall. I just went up this path, walked about 20 minutes in the wrong direction. There's a fork in the road. I chose that one. It was supposed to be this one. Okay? Why do I tell you that? Why do I tell you that? Why do I tell you that? Dude. I've been on the wrong path many a fucking times. Many, many, many times. How do you think I can talk from the gut and tell you guys this now? Because I've been on the wrong path. Came back and found the right path, okay? Find the right path for you. You got dreams to be Justin Bieber. You're not gonna be Justin Bieber but you can land somewhere in the music industry. You can be a producer, you can be an engineer, you can be a singer that has a following of a thousand people and you can do shows, 50 people. You know, 50 people shows in any city, you can make a career out of music. That's huge. I use music as an example because I come from the music industry. Point is this, whatever you want to do, you can find a fan base for it. You can build it up. Stay dedicated, take the wrong path, find the right path, and follow the voice in your heart. Follow the voice in your heart. When you follow the voice in your heart, let me give you a couple tips though. Make sure it's moral. Make sure it benefits other people. And make sure that it's true to yourself and not fulfilling just a superficial need. Make sure it's not fulfilling a superficial need. That way you can sleep good at night, you'll feel good about yourself, and you're not just trying to impress the next person. That's not what this is about. This is like a return to God, a return to your spirit. We work on our mind, body, and soul every day. That's what I want for you. I want the best. I want you to be happy, I want you to feel good, I want you to be feeling at peace. Let's get it, guys. This is your year. Much love, much love. Stay dedicated.